on accidents. Last month, July, we have registered 45 uh, accident cases with fatal 16, serious 21, and minor 8. With different numbers registered per district, Aleptong we had 1, Amolata last month we had nil. A patch district we had a three. That is Fato. Dokolo we had one. Kole we had one. Kwania we had three. Lira we had four. Otuke one. Anuyam district two. Giving us the total of 16. Then Sirius we had a lepton one. Amorata 1, Apache 1, Dokolo 3, Kole Nil, Kwania 2, Lira 8, Potuke 1, Anoyam 4. Give you a total of serious accident 21. Minor in a leptom we had Nil, Amorata Nil, Apache Nil, Dokolo we registered 5, Kole we registered 1, Kwania we registered 1. Lira nil, Otoke nil, Oyam nil, giving us report of eight minor accident cases. So when we total all this, you realize that in a lepton, there were two, Amolata one, Apache four, Dokolo nine, Kole two, Kwania six, Lira twelve, Otoke two, and Yam District 7, giving us a total of 45. This is as per uh, cases reported uh, to the police. Now, the people who died, we registered 19 people who died out of the 16 cases that was registered. And uh, people who were seriously injured were 41. Then those one who were slightly injured was only one, giving us a total of 61 uh, victims. This is how uh, we have raided them. Now, some of the causes of these accidents include uh, reckless riding and driving, overspeeding, dangerous loading, careless driving, and the nature of the roads that we have uh, in this region. These are some of the contributing uh, factors. Of course, not forgetting those ones who drive while uh, speaking on phone. We also had uh, uh, cases of people who were driving while uh, speaking on phone. Finally, we have other uh, selective uh, crime uh, report for the month of May, June, and July for the entire uh, North Kyoga region. These cases include one, murder by shooting. In the last three months, we had three. Then murder by mob. In the last uh, three months, we registered 18. Murder by poisoning, nil. Murder as a result of aggravated uh, domestic uh, violence, we had five. Then murder by assault, we have, I mean, we registered 34, giving us a total of murder in general, 60 cases in the last uh, three months. We had cases of rape. There were 12 registered in the last uh, three months. Defilement, 190 registered in the last three months. Child-related cases, 259 in the last three months. Shop or home breaking. We had 242 in the last three months thefts. We had 978 in the last uh, three months assaults. We had 816 in the last three months domestic violence. We had 315 in the last three months. And uh, cases relating to our environment, we had uh, 10 uh, cases. Fish and Crocodile Act. This is along the legs. We had uh, 32 uh, cases registered. 
and other crimes in general, all in all, 991, giving us a total in the region for the last uh, three months, cases registered as highlighted, 3,905. Per month, May we had 1,432. 1, June we had 1,260. July we had 1,213. You can see the trend at which the cases uh, we are getting as per the region in line to monthly reports that we get. So May we had many cases, June it reduces, and also in July it kind, kind of came down. So that means, uh, as you can look at these cases, somehow the trend is not increasing, but rather reducing. But we have also, on top of the strength that we are putting in place as police to reduce on these reported cases, where we do a community policing and crime prevention, particularly on different radio stations within the region, actual community engagement, and arrest and prosecution. We also have some challenges that we get from members of the public. Through you, we believe this message will reach uh, the community members. We have situations where people report cases and stay put. After coming to police, they don't follow up these cases. Yet, it is already registered. We have a situation where, after reporting, people fail to support police with evidence or even make statements. Sometimes people come, make a report, and walk away. Then we also have uh, a situation where interference at the crime scene. We have seen this when the case of murder has been registered, when we introduce our canine uh, on ground, Sometimes it fails and loses track, simply because the environment in which the incident happened has already been interfered with by our members of the public who move swiftly to see what happened in a particular uh, uh, crime scene. So we are here encouraging members of the public that if an incident happened for purposes of coming up with new methods of identifying suspects, like we've been using our canine for the dog, let us avoid interfering or moving at the crime scene. At the end of the day, the dog can again track you who could have moved just to witness and see what happened. So this is our appeal. But also above all, we appeal to members of the public that for a successful investigation of cases to reach to court, to the level where prosecution is done by the magistrate or the uh, judges in court, we need support from members of the public. Support us with evidence, make your statement. If it means coming to testify before court, it is very, very welcome because that is where the judges and the magistrates will rely and make their judgment through your participation in these processes. Thank you very much.